Hello, welcome to the second episode of Remember Disney Infinity Pirates Edition. So, today we're doing Captain Barbosa, as you can guess by the title and the picture. Captain Barbosa is a sword fighter, so he has only has three three moves. He also has a pistol, and then he also has a ground slam, and then he also has to roll, so yeah. So that's basically all I could say about Captain Barbosa. Sorry that this came out video this video came out so late. I'm messing up my words. But sorry that this came out late, it's just that I've just been having this basically been recorded. Except for this part. Everything's been done before this part yet. I just haven't had the time to edit it. <laughs> I might be doing something new the next couple times, so yeah. Let's get into the clips. So here we can see Captain Barbosa in game. Here's how his max speed is when you upgrade him in his running. He also only has double jumps. He doesn't have a super jump. You can double jump by pressing the X button twice and signal jump by pressing X once. And here's his pistol, which is his R2 ability, which makes him shoot a foot like pistol. Then you can also aim with R2, L2. Here's his attacks, when you can press with triangle, he only has three combos. If you hold down triangles, you can do it. this dash attack. You also can do the dodges and blocks. Here we have the ground pound. If you do the ground pound, if you jump into the sky and then you press triangle, you do a ground pound. I'm going to spawn in some enemies so that we can test out his abilities. So here's his generic attacks. That's how decent they are. It's kind of good, it's decent. But so let's check out his flint lock. With the the battle droids is basically one shot them no matter what. But sometimes you might get it so that it doesn't one shot sometimes because everything is confusing. I don't know why I did that though. <laughs> Just try to try see if I can climb it up. So here we're gonna see his mm, jump attack. I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Here we go. It takes like two hits just to kill him. You have to hit him directly to kill him. Here's his hold down. We just saw what it did to a already low health. So it does take two hits with the ground pound to kill him immediately. And so yeah, it's not really worth doing the ground pound, although there's a whole lot of targets and you need to knock him down on the ground. So after this we're gonna see his long his long tag. So bonk. It it can kill two enemies in one strike. It, and I can one shot battle droids, so yeah, it's pretty, it's pretty decent. It does have a light range onto it, and also you can miss very easily with it. So I don't really recommend using it. I recommend using the standard attacks. So in a couple of seconds, we're gonna look at the skill tree. Here's the skill tree. It's what we're gonna see. He has maximum health increase, mid-air recovery, and uh, whatever that is, speed. <laughs> damage increase, and that's his parry. This increases his damage from his pistol, and he also is a marksman, and that's the only points he has. So, yeah, he's not really the best. I don't really personally use him. I personally use more the 3.0 figures and the 2.0 figures. <coughs> But so, he, he's not bad, he's not great though. The next video will be Davy Jones, so look forward to that. And then we're going to be doing another playset, which is probably going to be either Incredibles or a completely different playset, so yeah. Just, just look forward to that. I don't know why you would, but just look forward to it.